Welcome. Good morning. Good morning. You already know. Inhale on four. The feeling. Keep it going again. Of having stuck in your head. A song. That's what this story is about. The music we can't shake off. That's where the magic comes in. Mary Leonard and Marge Ostrushko. They have it there. Are the founders of Giving Voice Chorus. I like music. Inspired by what stuck with them. We both have had parents with Alzheimer's. My father. My mother and we decided to work together. Which is why the Twin Cities now has a choir for Alzheimer's patients. She knew something was wrong with me because I was starting to forget things. When the diagnosis came at age 56, it hit Jerry Parks and his wife, it's, Karen, it's, um, like a brick. It's a horrible disease. It robs its victims of themselves, of everything they are. But the thief that is Alzheimer's has a more difficult time prying away our songs. Da, da. We know that music is stored in a part of the brain that's last affected by Alzheimer's disease. Love to have my fun. The emotions, the joy, the fun, the humor that came with singing when they were 18 or 24 or 40 comes back. I love women. Rehearsing weekly at McPhail Center for Music, the choir is evenly split between memory care patients and their caregivers. Can't, good. Can't say it yet. Doris Sterner's condition causes her words to jump. It's frustrating. Sometimes she can't say it, well, <laughs> right? But she can sing the songs. Mother and daughter crushing stigmas together. It's just been uplifting. It's wonderful. Love, love me do. So don't fight that song stuck in your head. It's just there waiting for a day. You may need it. Ba, ba, ba. Boyd Hooper, Care 11 News, oh, you rock. Minneapolis. Bravo.